Hi everyone, it's Matt from Cambridge Longbows here again. I thought I'd show you something different today. I made this out of scrap wood. Now, there's a common thinking amongst bowyers that if you're going to draw a bow to 28 inches, then each of the limbs, the bending, the working part of the limb, should actually be 28 inches to accommodate that. Now, with this piece of hickory is too short. The piece of hickory is only about 54 inches long. So I thought hickory really is indestructible. So I thought, well, do you know what? I'll try going against the rules and making something really short for a change with a 28 inch draw. So rather than binning this, this was gonna be just kindling. But I just got a bit of sapili, stuck it on to brace the handle section so this doesn't bend through the handle section at all. So it's just for limbs which are bending. Okay, and then I made these just little wooden horns out of again just out of a bit of sapili that again was going to go in the bin and tillered it up to 28 inches. It comes in at 45 pound draw weight, which is fine. I'm going to use it as an indoor bow. Um, and I think the timber for this probably only cost about 10 quid, maybe, maybe not even that, probably maybe five quid. So, and it's all off cuts. So you, you can, if, if you get the right bits of junk, you can make a fantastic bow. I'll shoot some arrows through it so you can see. But um, it's just a nice little recurve. Well, it's not a recurve because these are static. The ends are static. But have a look, see what you think. There you go, simple, <laughs> and I think I'm going to love shooting it. Perfect for indoors. Okay, thanks for watching, everyone. Bye. Oh, by the way, if there's anything that you want to see, whether you want to see me um, teach how to do gluing or tillering or any part of bow making, if you want to see how to make a Flemish string or, or anything, um, just drop me a note and, and I'll uh, do a video on it if I can. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.